Hello all, welcome to Rush Outside Wales as we're in uh, the Brecon Beacons for another adventure with Mark and Simon from Twin Peaks Wild Camping. Hello Simon. Hello Mark. Hello Dan, Hi. looking forward to this one. Yeah, so today's uh, adventure is going to be taken in the Carmarthen Fan, as they call it. Uh, a few nuttles along the way, we're going to drop down, have a bit of a wild camp, or have a bit of time in the shelter at Llinafan Fac and then tomorrow morning we're going to make our way back um, back to the starting point which is here so hopefully you enjoy it and come along and join us on this little adventure see you in a bit Hello again, there's a the pub we've left, there's Mark and Simon, we're now on the Beacons Way, we're heading up this way. It's surprisingly warm, very warm, hat's come off already. Forecast is quite favourable for the walk, might see some rain around six o'clock tonight already we've gained a bit of a scent look at the view in the valley absolutely brilliant First summit in view now, at about 400 metres of ascent straight from the pub. <sighs> Tough going on the legs, but once we get to that highest point there, it is practically all downhill after that point. <sighs> so, I'll uh, bring you back in a bit. Sorry for blowing out my bottom. Penafan and Cribbin just come into view. Awesome. Fair play. Some good views today. Onwards and upwards we go. Hello again. So this little peak you see in front of us, fan here. It's not a nut all, unfortunately. But uh, look at the drop off. 
you think that was carved out from the ice age and then right across cribbing on a bit um penifan in the distance there cracking views the weather is quite decent as well so once we're up here now on this ridge the walk gets a hell of a lot easier you know that's been a bit of a slog to get up here but these views are worth it First couple of people we've seen on this walk come into view. Apologies if I pronounced it wrong. So that's where we're heading. Back then Nuttles drop down to Clinifan Fach, camp around there. Happy days. Mark to the 
the left. that guys, Piquisty, sun in the background, there's Linnafan Fach and the shelter, we're going to pitch up somewhere around there, have a, something to eat and drink in the shelter, happy days, I do reckon to this though boys, stunning isn't it, look at that, it looks like it's got a little sun hat on, look at that, yeah, and you think how it's been cut off the the glacier from the ice age? Stunning. So, topping out now on the final nut all of the day, pick whisty. Then, after this one, drop down, pitch it to the front back, go by to eat, beverage or two in the shelter. It's been an epic trip up to now. Fair play. We've had the weather for it as well. It's been a bit blowy at Poi. Apart. Apart from what we've had today. Absolutely brilliant. Enough for me. Have a look at this. Heading down now, off the peaks, heading down to the shelter where we can get pitched, have somewhere to sit, eat, drink, be merry. Quite shielded now from any wind here at the minute, so I'm hoping that stays. Uh, the ground underneath is a bit slippy, but I don't know if you can make it out. 
and that's the ridge we've walked across and we're heading down to the foot of that lake happy days so the rain's starting to come down a bit now I've pitched for some reason I've had a hell of a job pitching tonight what I've done is I've replaced the inner with a four season inner and it looks like it might be too big or it needs some mods first but I've got it to, good enough for me to sleep in tonight so we'll see how it goes Inside the shelter where we sat last night, got the fire. Um, I'm glad it's quite dark, there's some graffiti there isn't for uh, YouTube. <laughs> Look at this as you come out. There you go, that's where we were camped. Everything packed away. No marks, no nothing. Remember guys, leave no trace if you're gonna be doing stuff like this. Well guys, that's the end of that walk, I'd say the walk back from camp on the shelter and Clinefant Fack is actually worse than going over the ridges, oh, that's just me, just the ground was awful under feet, it was, it was terrible, and oh, we never slipped coming back, anyway, it was enjoyable, more nut holes ticked off and bagged, uh, it's been a cracking overnight. Uh, hope you've enjoyed it too. Um, again, thanks to Mark and Simon from Twin Peaks Wild Camping. And I'll just flip you back around to finish off as we started off from yesterday. Cracking pub. Well, that's it guys, like I say, thanks for watching, 
see you on the next one